the audience that I'm talking to. Uh, how many of you know someone who has been suicidal, felt suicidal, and said that to you? And you can include yourself. Raise your hands. I'm going to take a class with that. That's probably over half. Okay. Well, uh, then we, so we should have some fun with a morbid topic. <coughs> this is actually a two part talk. There's a kind of a lab session, which is sort of an experiential thing at the beginning. And then afterwards, uh, there's a discussion where we'll talk with each other. For the first part, uh, however, uh, I'm going to have to become someone else temporarily for about 30 or 40 minutes unless I have trouble getting back to me. And the person I'm going to become is a lot different than Dr. Goulston. He doesn't wear sport jackets. He's never in style. He's always a couple of years behind style. <laughs> My apologies to the people who are wearing this kind of bus. <laughs> and he doesn't, uh, he doesn't wear. That, I'll stop here. He doesn't wear shirts. And he uh, doesn't sit in a classroom like this. And as I become this person, I want you to ask yourself seven questions. You might even write them down. What is he thinking? Why shouldn't he kill himself? How can you stop him from killing himself? How can you buy some time? How can you give him hope? See, I'm already becoming him because those are only six questions. Never do anything like it. Smart class. <laughs> My name is Jack. I'm 21. I've never made it as far as any of you. And I'm not going to make it much further. I'm old enough to vote. I'm old enough to kill myself. And you have about 35 minutes. Well, I'll do it. I came prepared. I always screw things up. If I take these, I'm going to kill myself with constipation. <laughs> well, this should work. Thank you. 
the other ones, you wouldn't get me through uh, 